So, uh, position of the wick here. On the last week, start to study positions from warm guard here. So, uh, everything to the same side. This week here, when I start to go to that side here, the guy make a back step. When he made a back step here, or when he make a back step, or I kick him away, I like to put the reverse de la riva behind, you know, so, and I kick him here. Now I put de la riva to the ground and complete to, to wrap my leg here. So for the position number one, start to make this simple here. Just a little cross here. So on the detail number one here, you try to put your elbow above your owner knee. You try to put your elbow above your owner knee. This is start to be good, or you fall in a good spot to pass the guard. Avoid he put his knee outside to make a guard. You know, so now when my elbow here over my knee, I swallow his knee and avoid he uh, uh, defense in a couple more seconds. So I trap his leg here too. And when I lift my hip up, I towards his butt to the ground, fall. If you, his knee is outside here, he start to defend. If you, his knee is inside here, it's better for me pass. Do not walk straight. Use the leg on his thigh to push him in sideways. When you push him in sideways, now the creativity is about your mind. Some guys prefer to go straight to mount and fight against his strength. Some guys like to go to straight to arm bar here. Some guys like to put in beating bowl and go to. So, whatever you want. So, in the first one, like last week, I start to go here. The guy make a back step. I kick him away, wrap my leg, change. Remember to the elbow over your owner knee. When you sweep him, kick him away. And enjoy whatever you want, beating ball or bar mount to your ears with you. In the option number two, in the option number two, I have the same setup, but this guy tried to be faster and smart than me. When I do this and I up here, he when I grab this, he go his leg around. I follow him with shin to shin. When shin to shin, with shin to shin. He have this support fight against me here, you know? So, or you grab the sleeve here, or depending on the situation, you open his elbow, but you towards his both knee to the ground and lift his leg up. When you lift his leg up, start to work here. Hold him, let it go the lapel, and kick him away when you pull in the same time to work about his back. When you arrive in his back here, you have two situations. Depending on this arm here, arm bar. Depending on the situation, back attack. My concern for you, if you back attack from here, the underarm is this arm, not the other one. Why? Because you have the pressure about the leg to put over the shoulder to submit. If you get the arm under this side, you need to change for the other side to put the leg over, so you make a short cut. So, option number two. Move, enter, wrap, shin to shin, pressure on his knee, lift him up, open his elbow, boom. Hold, back attack, arm bar, or Option number three, that same hand we have in my shoulder, start to fight for my arm, no enter, no enter. I put under my owner leg and make a grip here. When I have this here, start to fight against his arm here. If you have a grip, you put your knee inside, break. Spider, bring to me. Bring him down. Come back to option number one. Arm bar, beating ball, whatever you want. That's okay. Three options for you here. I hope you guys enjoy. Uh, watch the video how many times you want. One, two.